Hi, I'm Dave of L. David Likes Photography. This is my first video on removing red eye uh, in Photoshop Element 6. Uh, the new version 8 is out. Uh, it works in both versions and also the Big Brother Photoshop program. Click the zoom tool. We'll go in. You can see I have a little boy with red eye eyes. Okay, red eye, uh, in this case, is where the flash is too close to the camera and causes uh, the retina in the back of the eye uh, to light up, which is red blood vessels, and you get red eye. Uh, I use, as a professional photographer, I take the flash above the camera with a flash bracket. Uh, using point and shoot, that's pretty hard to eliminate, even if you have... Uh, uh, reduction, red eye reduction. This is the um, standard tool, the red eye tool. Works somewhat okay. You can also come up the auto. Uh, I suggest using the color replacement tool, and that's going to be my tip for this lesson, this video. Color replacement tool works much better, in my opinion. Make sure your foreground color is on black. Okay, if it's not, then you click click around either one of these two arrows until your foreground color is black. That's what we're going to be replacing the red eye with, uh, the black. Um, color can be on color mode in the options bar or hue. We'll stay with color. Sampling can be continuous or once, but not this third one over background color or background sampling. It will not work there. So. We're going to go to sampling once. Make sure you're on contiguous so it won't go outside the red eye to pick anything else. If it was discontiguous, it would go, you could go actually pull out, pull red out of the uh, skin tones. We're going to stay with contiguous. 30% tolerance and anti aliasing. And all you have to do, well, first of all, um, let's get the brush size set a little smaller lowering the diameter here. It does not, the brush size does not have to be as the same size as the red eye. It can be bigger as long as we're on contiguous. But the big thing here is to get this little X in the center of the circle over the red that you want to replace. You just click once with the mouse. There you go. In the right eye, now the left eye, click once right on the red and it removed all the red and did not go outside the eye, changing any of the red in the skin or anything else. And um, this is my undo history if you want to see. Uh, this is after you want to see before. That was before with the red eye. Now, after. Zoom back out. And we have a nice picture with no red eye. That's my suggestion. Um, good luck with your images. Dave, L. David Likes Photography. Thanks for watching.